Although Sister Wives star Robin Brown has kept most of Kobe Brown's attention, she still found it necessary to jab her sister wives. For instance, there were several occasions when Robin spoke in a derogatory way to Shane Janelle Brown. Recently, fans discussed a scene where Robin buys Janelle a shirt that is too small to embarrass her. But Robin's scheming backfires on her. While reviewing past episodes, fans have seen another interaction that shows Robin being petty when talking about Janelle. On Reddit, a Sister Wives fan points out an instance where Robin takes an unnecessary jab at Janelle Brown. First, the user says, oh yeah, she's shady, then adds a series of screenshots of Robin slighting Janelle in a confessional interview. Then adding to their post, the user says, so Janelle is excited about driving the new truck. Not only does Grody squash it by saying he doesn't want it driven by a soccer mom, but then Robin piles on with her little digs. She's not cute. They were referring to the scene where Cody Brown has purchased his late brother's truck. Part of the justification was to pull Janelle Brown's RV. Janelle decides since Maddie can drive Caleb's truck, she would figure out how to make it work. Cody doesn't like the idea and feels the need to protect from soccer moms taking over his truck. So Robin says, it's kind of a funny thought, like seeing Janelle all over Flagstaff in this big, huge truck. I've also heard funny stories about Janelle struggling to drive big vehicles and to do things and stuff like that, so I don't know. But fans didn't find it to be very funny, especially since Cody and Robin weren't on board with Mary Brown purchasing her late mother's B&B, &B, but Cody was using the family money freely to buy this truck. Other fans weigh in on Robin's comments about Janelle Brown. Some even remember that Robin drove the truck and how it was a direct criticism of Janelle. One Sister Wives fan gives their thoughts on the body-shaming aspect of Robin's comment about Janelle Brown. Yup, cuz Janelle is shorter slashed kinda chubby, it would be hard for her to get into the truck. My own mom is built kinda like Janelle, though much shorter and watching her try to climb in my dad's truck to drive is adorable and implying that since she's so young and fit, driving it isn't a problem for her. Continuing this poster adds, I'm not the typical Robin hater, so when I say she's been a snarky bastardist titch about the other women's weight slashed bodies and age, it's not just another accusing Robin of everything bad and evil in the world, it's acknowledging a theme this bastardist titch has stuck to since the jump. Which is why, as a bigger girl myself, it's beyond satisfying to see Robin becoming frumpy and dumpy as she ages, much less gracefully than her older, heavier, and formerly less pretty sister wives. Karma is a bastardist to bastardists. What do you think about Robin's comment about Janelle Brown driving a truck? Do you think she was shaming Janelle? Was it about how her body fits in a truck? Are you hoping to see more sister wives episodes? Tell us what you think in the comments below. In the quietude of their shared home, tensions simmered beneath the surface as Janelle Brown, one of the sister wives, felt the weight of Robin's disapproval bearing down on her once again. It seemed that no matter how hard she tried, she could never quite meet Robin's standards. As she busied herself with daily tasks, a knot of unease tightened in her chest, knowing that another storm was brewing on the horizon. Robin's disapproval was palpable, a silent accuser lurking in the shadows of their polygamous household. Whether it was the way Janelle arranged the furniture or the meals she prepared for the family, Robin always seemed to find fault, her judgmental gaze casting a shadow over Janelle's every move. As Janelle went about her day, she couldn't shake the feeling of being under constant scrutiny, her confidence eroded by Robin's relentless criticism. It was as if she could never quite measure up to the ideal of perfection that Robin held in her mind, leaving her feeling small and insignificant in her own home. One fateful evening, tensions finally reached a boiling point as Robin's judgment turned from silent disapproval to open confrontation. With the rest of the family gathered around, Robin seized the opportunity to shame Janelle once again, her words cutting like a knife through the air. You always put your needs above everyone else's. Robin accused, her voice dripping with disdain. You never consider how your actions affect the rest of us. Janelle felt her cheeks flush with embarrassment as Robin's words struck a nerve. It was true that she often prioritized her own needs, but she had never intended to cause harm to the family. 
Tears welled in her eyes as she struggled to find the words to defend herself, her heart heavy with the weight of Robin's judgment. As Janelle grappled with the aftermath of Robin's accusations, she knew that she couldn't continue to live under the shadow of her sister-wife's judgment. With a newfound sense of resolve, she sought out a private moment with Robin, determined to confront the issue head-on. Robin, I know that you have concerns about how I contribute to the family, Janelle began, her voice steady despite the tremble in her hands. But I want you to know that I'm doing the best I can. We're all in this together, and I believe that we can find a way to support each other instead of tearing each other down. Robin's expression softened slightly as she listened to Janelle's words, her own insecurities laid bare in the face of Janelle's vulnerability. With a sigh, she nodded in acknowledgement, realizing that her judgment had only served to drive a wedge between them rather than build a stronger bond. As the dust settled on their confrontation, Janelle and Robin found themselves at a crossroads, their relationship forever changed by their shared experience. In the days that followed, they made a conscious effort to communicate openly and honestly, striving to overcome the barriers that had divided them for so long. Slowly but surely, their efforts began to bear fruit as they learned to set aside their differences and embrace the unique strengths that each of them brought to the family. With each passing day, their bond grew stronger, fortified by the knowledge that they were stronger together than they ever could be apart. And so, as the sun set on another day in their polygamous household, Janelle and Robin found solace in the knowledge that, no matter what challenges lay ahead, they would face them together as sisters, united in their shared journey of love, acceptance, and forgiveness.